Yeah, we we still suck. Like this recap's just gonna be like the last one. Um, but let's get into it. Yesterday or today, depending on what goes and how fast I edit this, probably yesterday, the Houston Astros dropped yet another one run game to the Toronto Blue Jays. If we weren't heading into this game on a three game losing streak and sub five hundred, I'd say, hey, losing a one run game to the Blue Jays. Okay, that's not that bad as far as things are concerned. Like, surely at least we scored some, right? And our offense was looking back at it. No, it wasn't. Um, spoiler alert. Our player of the game is... It could be Alex Bregman or it could be Michael Brantley. Because Brantley had three hits, but Bregman had a home run. And he was responsible for both runs. But his home run did have a 7% hit percent hit probability. So let's just go with Brantley. Brantley is your player of the game. Um, Alec Manoa, he looked good. <laughs> that slider was so nasty. Like, oh my gosh. I don't even know what to say about it. Um, our offense looked bad again, though. Like, we muffled up 6 hits, I think, against Alec Manoa. I think that's a career high against him. Yet, we still couldn't score like what is up with this we scored two in the first and then we couldn't score anything and then actually now that i think about it today is really embarrassing because this could have been so prevented oh my gosh it's like all the cards are stacked against us and like yes we suck that's not an excuse to be losing all this stuff but the umpires have not been helping at all the this series they've looked fine but there was that call against um Santiago Espinal on a 1-2 pitch that was called a ball and then on the first slider that Blake Taylor threw to Santiago Espinal he hit the game winning home run so I don't I don't know I and then Jeremy Pena Nico Goodrum what what happened on that sack fly like what was that you guys somebody has to call it I guarantee if Nico Goodrum does not fall to the ground, Bo Bichette does not score there. George Springer lead off home run. Who didn't see that coming? It was Jose Urquidy. Jose Urquidy surprisingly did very well after the first inning today. I did not expect that. Good for them. Two runs could have been very avoidable though. One on us. That's that's our fault for not having that communication. Nico Goodrum, Jeremy Pena both weren't on the Astros last year. So we that that was that's frustrating when it's a stupid mistake by us. The ump kind of blew that call in the in the eighth, seventh, seventh, I think, eighth, I think it's the eighth actually. Whatever it was, no, it was the seventh. Whatever it was, ump completely blew that. He he needed to be making that call. That was a strike. Santiago Espinal struck out, and then I don't know why. Someone decided to throw a slider out of nowhere, and Santiago Espinal made us pay for it. All in all, though, we didn't really deserve to win. Like, we weren't scoring. Our only runs came from a home run with a 7% hit probability. Only Minute Maid Park would have uh, had that gone out. And, yeah, that, like, realistically, we shouldn't have scored anything. But we have a lineup that's more than capable of scoring. In fact, last year... And a lot of people are like, oh, yeah, we're playing like tough teams and stuff. The Angels are good, yes. The Mariners are good, yes. The Blue Jays are very good. But last year, we were beating the good teams. We sucked against the bad teams last year. So, again, like our offense isn't really doing anything. Kyle Tucker had three hits, by the way. So, good for him. He should get a banner, too, I guess. Um, he wore batting gloves. That was cool. But all in all, again, this is so embarrassing because this was very winnable. At the same time... We didn't deserve the win. We didn't really score any real runs. But we gave away so many runs. Or two runs. Not a lot of runs. But we gave those away. And then, like, I don't know. It's really... It doesn't make sense. And baseball script writers, be original, bro. Like, everyone knew a George Springer leadoff home run was coming. Can you guys at least try to be surprising? Um, and that's, that's really all there is to say. Jeremy Pena... Nico Goodrum, th those two, like they, they need to talk about that play because that play basically single handedly or half handedly, double handedly. That response that was responsible for half of our loss, I'd say. And then another, another quarter 
is is um on the ump and then the other quarter was on our offense just not scoring anything after the first inning so we need to wrap it up it seems like everything's going bad when we have a good pitching performance our offense can't score and then when we have a bad pitching performance our offense still can't score like what what happened to our offense we were the best offense in baseball last season the best thank you guys for watching if you guys want to stay tuned for more of whatever this video is Feel free to subscribe right here if you guys just want to check out some more videos right now. This is my most recent upload. Again, thank you guys for watching. And as always, it is Stro season, all season.